We're really excited to launch the new Guardian Collection, which is a range of products inspired by culture and creativity. I'm working with The Guardian for about nine years and I wanted on this project to almost continue the way that we normally work. Usually they will send me 2,000 words and then I will send them my interpretation of these 2,000 words. On this project I wanted to continue the same thing but instead of 2,000 words to have just one sentence. We chose the six themes for these notebooks by taking six areas of the Guardian, which we thought would translate nicely into notebooks. Once we'd chosen those themes, we brainstormed lists of words that could be turned into an image. It started with words, so my work is pretty much rely on, on written word. From brief that I get, I print the brief and I start to sketch. Sometimes I'm sketching in the studio, or high, most of the time in the Highgate hood. Then I'm coming to the studio and I start to scan or to photograph my sketches and I start to work on, on the computer. And when I'm quite happy with the result, I can start to send things to, to the clients. So we were trying to come up with a phrase that had two or three parts to it, either two things that related to, for example, travel, but they could also relate to the idea of notebooks. So make some notes we really, really liked that demonstrates how Noma works quite well. Two headphones that would be almost hang from the top of book or iPad cover. We like the fact that we're using different edges of each frame, so here is like almost stretching the, the border, the top border, and just a small image on the, on the edge. I think the more you look at his work, the more you can, you start reading things into it. Uh, with the shoe, first you see the shoe, which is just this crazy shape in bright pink, uh, and then you see the hand within the heel. And then you start thinking about that. Basically, in, in all of them, there is a mix of icons. So, you know, hand up, say, help. And high heel shoe, say, fashion. So two things that in our mind are known as iconic. When they mix together, there is a spark and they start to work well. Or sport, which is a happy thing to win trophy. But when you win trophy, someone is losing the trophy. Um, news as well, it's about observing, looking, journalism, which I discover a person in, in, inside binoculars. I see it as a graphic uh, storytelling. Uh, it's about starting from one point and ending the illustration in, in other points. I think the white quill is one that demonstrates Noma's work really well. First glance, you see this beautiful, elegant shape. It's the, the writing quill, and then you look closer, and you'll see the profile of a face in the vein of it. It's just a lovely image, um, and it definitely takes a couple of seconds to get to get that. And then, of course, you can't stop seeing it. And we've used a phrase full of character for that, and we just felt. You know, that applied to so many things. On each image there is a hidden thing, a second reading. So most of the things that you see here are not straightforward. You, you, you look at them at first, there is a first view, and then when you spend one or two or five seconds with the image, you start to discover more and more things. And through the years I realized that, you know, it's a less is more is cliche, but it, it just, it's so true to what I'm, what I'm doing. And I think The Guardian is a good example to kind of how just one color, it's very simple, you know, just one color printed on folder or, or notebook, just tell, tell, tell the whole story.